Let's talk some toys in here. <laughs> hey, what's going on, everyone? Today, it's the man child. Okay, so yeah, I picked up some uh, Conan the Barbarian from Super 7. This is the uh, war paint Conan from the uh, 1982 movie with uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger's character who played Conan the Barbarian. Yeah, it looks pretty cool, man. I love the uh, box, the art, and uh, just, yeah, it comes with a spare head, so let's check him out. So yeah, the box comes with this cool cover. It kind of looks like a book if you're not familiar, right? Pull cover, slides off like so. All right, we already seen the front. Yeah, I love the layout. Like I said, yeah, the sword, the spare head, okay. There's our back. Bring the bio in close. You want to read it? And it also comes in this mailer box, more or less. I don't save these, but if you're curious, it comes in that. Okay, so we got a Conan out of the box. Uh, yeah, I mean, just sculpt is awesome. I mean, the face looks very much, very identical to the movie, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, the hair looks great. I love that war paint. Now, as far as the head, so it comes with two heads. This is the first head, obviously, just with a uh, closed mouth. And with our articulation, obviously, okay, left to right. Um, forward and back not kind of tight doesn't go do too much comes with that little necklace it's already on the neck and that will come off once you pop the head off out of shoulders we got looks like a big ball joint in there okay spin around go out go more or less it's only gonna go in about that far okay we have like a swivel joint or the bicep cut there um what's interesting with these is it has pinless joints in the elbows that's pretty cool but it's just really just a ratchet joint i think so it can only just going to go back and forward. That's about it. Um, and then we also have a ratchet joint in hand. And it's going to go in and out. And it can spin as well. Let me bring it about that far into the chest. Like if you had a weapon or whatnot. And as far as the chest, uh, we have a rab crunch. Like this. Okay, it can spin at the waist. Um, yeah, the legs go all the way out. That's, I like that articulation. It's cool. We can do that. Okay. Um, cool loincloth. Kind of the front to the back. Also have pinless joints at the knees, which is neat. And you can go all the way back, like so. Uh, we got this cool boot and, you know, an articulation of foot. You can spin and go up and down. It also looks like just a ratchet joint in there, but it spins at the foot, I think. And for the accessories, it comes with the uh, alternate head, right? We got the scream in or the open the war mouth, getting ready to go in battle. He also comes with this cool sheath for the sword. Uh, looks like it clips onto the waist. I thought it went on the back, but yeah, I see a hole in the waist, so it comes with that. And we got two different sets of hands. These two are closed fist punching hands for left and right. And then uh, obviously left and right, the uh, gripping hands. Uh, these are the ones I'm going to put on for, at least for the sword to one side. And we got that awesome iconic Conan sword. Yeah, look at that. Got the, this one's got blood stain at the edge there. Yeah, just the way it's done is just incredible. So back to the sheet. That's more or less, yeah, it clips on the belt and the sword. That's as far as it goes in. It kind of hangs like that. It does fall off easy. I don't know. It kind of looks strange to me. I don't I might rig mine across the back with a strap or something. I don't know. I don't think I like that, but that's that's how it goes on anyway. So I'm changing out the hands to my uh, open, semi-open. It's it's awesome how easy they, the other ones come out, and these ones kind of just pop right in. That's it. That, I like that. You know, it's not like, you know, fighting them. And I pop the head off out of the box. So I'm curious what the ball peg looks like. Same one as the classics. All right, and that's our screaming head on, or the variant comes in a box. Okay, now what's interesting... So you already have a QC issue. Look at this. Ah, the head popped off. It looks like it was glued on. It came right off. I mean, you could push it on easy. A little silicone will hold that. But if you're curious what that looks like. All right. Get them all set up. Sword in hand. Battle ready face. There's a sheath back on the belt. All right. We got the open hand on the left side. Check that out. Just for a little side comparison. I got the last release Conan from Super 7. That was the iconic pose. Conan, I think it was called, or something, from a, you know, the familiar scene in the movie. All right, so that about sums it up on the Super 7, Conan the Barbarian, war paint figure. Um, I, I like him. I think he's really cool looking, you know? I love that war paint, the head sculpts, you know, the, uh, the head of sword, the whole deal. Uh, yeah, the sheath is accurate to the movie. It should hang down like that, I believe. But I think I'm going to get a leather strap of some sort and kind of rig mine across, have it across the chest and have this in the back. I think that will look cooler. That's just me. I have a QC issue in the hair. You see it's coming off. I'm going to take that off, put a little bit of silicone, let it dry, and that will fix that. Um, but otherwise, you know, it's and he, he matches in with your classics or revelation figures from your Motu stuff you want. So, yeah, I got mine on eBay. It wasn't a bad price. Somebody had some floating around, but I think Big Bad Toy Store might be getting some in. So I'll go check him out, you know. Um, but hope to answer all your questions on this figure. I hope everybody's doing great. And until next time, take care.